John 15 and verse 24. I read in the name of Jesus. If I had not done among them what no one else did, they could not be guilty of sin. But now they have seen these miracles, and yet they have hated both me and my father. Irusu ni some hiyo pia kwa Kiswahili 15:24. Kama sikuwa nimefanya miujiza ambayo haichapata kufanywa na mtu mwingine yeyote, wasingalikuwa na hatia ya thambi. Lakini sasa wameiona miujiza hii na bado wakatuchukia mimi na baba yangu. Nirudie. Kama sikuwa nimefanya miujiza ambayo haichapata kufanywa na mtu mwingine yeyote, wasingalikuwa na hatia ya thambi. Lakini sasa wameiona miujiza hii na bado wakatujukia mimi na baba yangu. Yesu anasema nini hapa? Anasema amefanya miujiza ambayo haichapata kufanywa na mtu mwingine. Lakini pia anasema kuna watu ambao hameifanya miongoni mwao wako na atia ya thambi. Kwa sababu waliiona hiyo miujiza na badala ya kumpenda yeye na baba yake wakamchukia yeye na baba yake unajua thambi watu wanajua thambi ni usinzi ni usharati ni kutukana mambo yote yale yameandikwa kwa waratia matendo ya mwili na mambo mengine ndio inajulikana kama thambi lakini hapa Yesu anazungumzia thambi nyingine ambayo ni ya kushuhudia miujiza na baadaye ukakosa kusadiki. Kanisa hili mahali mumekuja ni kanisa la miujiza. Sasa tuko kwa kitabu cha Yohana 15:24. Yesu anasema nini? Anasema amefanya miujiza. Na watu wamekataa kuamini. Si ni kweli? That John 15:24. Let me let me read again. Ini ya Kiingereza. Episongo. If I had not done among you works that no one else did, they could not be guilty of sin. No no, he's speaking about people. Anazungumza kuhusu watu ambao wamehesabiwa thambi kwa sababu wamemchukia na wamechukia baba yake na sababu ya kufanya wamchukie ni kwa sababu amefanya miongoni mwao miujiza ambayo hakuna mtu mwingine aliwaifanya. Yesu anakubali kwamba ndio kuna watu wamefanya fanya miujiza. That's what he saying. He's not disputing. Anasema kuna watu wamefanya miujiza, lakini aina ya miujiza nimefanya ni unique. Hallelujah. Na hata mimi nawaombea kama na vi wenu leo mpokee unique miracles in your life. If you believe stand up and say yes. Habia neiba tumechoka na miujiza ya kawaida. Sit down please. Hata mimi nimechoka na testimony za kawaida. Oh nimechenga nyumba. Oh nime nimenunua gari. Oh njoo anoint gari. Nataka nisikie pastor hii ndege umeona hapa. Ah. <laughs> Wote mimi mi, nimechoka. Oh niombe niende ngambo. Nataka nataka ufanye vitu fulani mpaka watu watoke ngambo waje kuona ni nini hii inaendelea. Are you getting what I'm saying? Is a time for unique miracles this year 2024. Now one thing you need to know, Yesu anasema miujiza imefanyika. Watu wamefanya miujiza, lakini anasema hiyo miujiza ilifanyika miongoni mwa hao watu ila anasema ile aina ya miujiza niliyoifanya miongoni mwenu haikuwaifanywa na mtu mwingine you received the unique miracles that were not common they were not done by anybody people did miracles among you but those miracles you can differentiate them clearly with the miracles i did because my miracles were of another level another type they were unique and you received them na anasema because you received them na mkakataa kunikubali na baba yangu mumehesabiwa thambi. Kwa hiyo kuna thambi ya kukataa miujiza. Kuna watu wanazungumza hapa ati miujiza ni fake fake. You go watch their families. They are going nowhere. They are cursing themselves. People think that rejecting a miracle is a small thing. Kwani miujiza wewe ndio umefanya? 
Siniche ofa. Can somebody clap for Jesus in this room? Sasa, mahali shida iko kubwa ni wakati wewe mwenyewe umeshuhudia baadaye ukaenda kinyume na kumkataa huyu Yesu na kukataa baba yake hapo kwako inahesabiwa fambi Anasema awangehesabiwa hatia ya fambi Kama singalifanya miuchiza anasema I wish I had not done this miracles among them they could be free of sin Hello wakati mwingine hata mimi naangaliaga watu ambao wanasema I wish I could have not delivered them they could be better Maana kuna mtu unamkomboa maisha yake baadaye yanakuwa mabaya zaidi kama mchungaji unaangalia unasema I wish ni singe ni muombea maana angekuwa afadhali sasa nimemuombea nimeondoa mapepo ndani yake yeye baada nimeondoa pepo moja ameenda ameyapokea mapepo wangapi Saba. hali yake ya baadaye imekuwa mbaya zaidi ninaona kama nimecontribute kuharibu maisha yako there are times wakati nakuangalia especially if i pray for you to be successful and you go you don't do anything at all definitely you will not be successful then i would say my prayer did not contribute anything it just made you worse no ni kuombea pastor nikitegemea utakwenda uchakalike niombe mnisema baba kwa jina la Yesu ninachilia baraka na neema kwa biashara yake na wewe hauendi kufanya chochote tukikuta next time nitakuta hali yako ni mbaya because through your faith you never took any action so you are, you are, you are, you are time there after will be worse so yesu alikuwa anachuta he was regretting ingikia ngireto i wish this is what jesus was saying i wish i had not done any miracle among them they could not be guilty of sin awange sabiwa atia ya thambi nisinge alifanya miujiza miongoni mwao ambayo mtu mwingine hajafanya lakini sasa Nilipata nafasi ya kufanya miujiza miongoni mwao ambayo haijafanya na mtu mwingine na baada ya kuifanya wakanichukia wakachukia na baba yangu sasa wamehesabiwa hatia ya fami Jesus was regretting I am the one that has caused them to cost it to be counted on them as sin because I did miracles and they refused Hakuna kitu kibaya kama special miracles and unique miracles I did a special miracles in this church in 2021. I have never done special miracles again. You remember the day when we came here for creative miracles. Wakati mwingine kama mchungaji ambaye nimeona mambo mengi ambayo watu wengine wachaona, inafika wakati ninajiambia ama nifanye ordinary kama wachungaji wengine ndio mtu akikuja hapa hata akienda kwingineo kwa anasema in any case makanisa ya miujiza yanafana yanafana na hatufanani. Atufanani. There are a lot of things one of the things that I have done in a very unique way is praying for people without money. That is not a small thing. Kuombea watu chinsi Biblia inasema it takes a sacrifice. Unatoka Nairobi unakuja na chukua ndege na kimbia chumatano kuombea watu ambao siwajui sichawahi waona na hakuna pesa wanatoa hakuna consultation hakuna sadaka kwa sababu ninafuata Matthew 10 verse 8 nasema wancho muwaponye na kuombea watu na sijui wanakwenda wapi kwingineko unaweza ambiwa ukiacha hii kanisa utaugua tena you can be told that eh unasomea biblia see now you are well if you leave this church the problem will come back hiyo ni uganga uganga uko na demands zake Yesu akikuponya unayesataka kumfuata akwambia hapana usinifuata enda kwenu enda kwenu ukaonyesha watu Yesu si wa kufuata ofuatu ofyo Yesu ni wa kushuhudiwa akikuponya kitu ambacho hataki hataki unyamase uwe ni mtu wa kuongea sema amen, amen. Bwana Yesu asifiwe Haleluya Hapa mimi nina, nina mambo saba ambayo yamenitendekea kama mchungaji na ambayo nitawaambia ili muelewe kwamba mimi pia ni nimeshuhudia unique miracles za Mungu na singependa kufanya mchezo na huyu Yesu na kama wewe umechunga na ili kanisa tafadhali and if you are sure kwamba umechunga na sisi usifanye mchezo na Yesu usifanye mchezo na Yesu